Grandma! Grandma, listen. Gra Stop sleeping. Oh, God! Hey, Grandma. Grandma. Yeah, nor you just turn into a bird. Well, it's not, that's not weird, it's normal. You never turn into a bird? I turn into a bird all the time. Good day, Dino friends. Last week, I recorded a game that is still being made, but in the video, I am new to it and I'm like mumbling about, so I decided to record this after intro pre-intro pre the intro this is the intro before the intro uh so today i'll be playing a game called roots of pasha i think it's pronounced pasha but i pronounce it like pacha while recording so i don't i don't know it's a game like stardew valley but set in the fantasy stone age where you can farm build a village with your friends befriend animals unlock recipes upgrade your tools and much more starting today you can support roots of pacha I said it again. Starting today, you can support Roots of Pasha on Kickstarter to help it be made. Also, if you want to talk to the makers of the game and play a chatbot version of the game, you can join their Discord. Also, make sure to wishlist it on Steam. All links are in the description. And yes, I know that sounds like I was reading it and that it's sponsored, but it's not. I just had to write all of that down so the video makes sense. Uh, okay, bye. Good day, Dino friends. Welcome back to day 300 of not being able to get a haircut because there's corona. Look, are you serious? Are you ser Are you serious? Anyway, today is a very special day because we've been given access to a game that isn't even out yet. Welcome to people from long ago, the game. Or, as some people like to call it, Roots of Pacha. It's a game about being in a village from the prehistoric times. And let's just, I'm just going to play it. Also, it's apparently about riding ostriches. That's, that's all I know. This is like the pre-alpha demo. Oh, you get to design your own guy. I love this. I love when you get to design your own guy. What body do I want? Oh, there's only two bodies because this is like the first version of the game. Child or big guy? Oh, wait, or is that woman? Oh, sorry, it might be woman, not child, sorry. <laughs> I don't know what color I should be. Eye color, uh, I'll just be brown, like real life. Ooh, you can have face tattoos. Can I have a beard? I mean, if you're in the ca if you're a caveman, usually they have like beards, right? No? This one is straight up Goku. Two hours later. Okay, fine, I'll be Goku. I'll be Goku. Uh, my name should be... Um, one eternity later. You know what? My tr my clan named me Dodo. There we go. I'm. It is me, Dodo. I want to be called Dodo. Good morning, Dodo. I woke up today thinking about Pacha, our mother nature. She has told us it is time to build our village. I'll rest some more now. Outside is the new land waiting for you. Be safe, my child. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. There, there is already a village. What does she mean like we have to build a village? Look at this. This is already pretty awesome. This is already... Look at this. I love the style of this game. Oh, and when you walk behind the tree, it becomes like transparent. Oh, that's nice. So you can see where you are. Oh, it doesn't work for the rock. Can I pick up like... <gasps> I can. You can pick up stuff. Igrork. Igrork says, we need something to fill our water skins faster if we are to grow food for the whole clan. I put my ears to the ground and listen to the flow of the water. Oh, it's like a quest. Ta-da! Quest. The river is not always close. Igwork says the... Uh, he put his ears to the ground and he heard the melody of water. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, so we make... A well. It will cost $75. Wait, what? What is this? What is C? Euros. It will cost 75 euros. It will take one day and 20 stone. Let's do it. Let's do it, Igrorg. I need more resources to research this. Okay, 20, 20 rocks. I will get you 20 rocks, Igrorg. Oh, maybe I need a tool. Like I need like an axe for this and maybe like a machete for the grass or something. 
Okay, I have no tools, I think. I have no tools, I think. I only have one flower. <gasps> oh, they're practicing. Come train with Grob and me sometime. Having good reflexes helps when exploring. Okay. All right. 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 Oh, this looks pretty good. They already have like a flower patch and everything. What did she mean by me having to build a village? We have a pretty sweet village going on here. Okay. I need to find a way to get stone. Oh, here's my quest. Talk to Mary. Uh, where's Mary? Hello? Mary. Different place. I'm lost already. Mary. Mary. She's sleeping. No, where did she go? Mary was the lady I talked to at the start, right? Actually, like two seconds ago. I've only been playing for like two seconds. Where is she go? She's she's old. She can't have gone far. She's really old. Oh, I have a rock. And you can like... Oh, that's probably what I can do to get rocks to get stone. Like this. Nope. No? Maybe here. <gasps> yes! Genius. Get out of my way. I need stone. Oh, oh that is pretty cool. So this is the Stone Age. We use... We solve all our problems with stone. Okay, I got 20 stone. 20 stone. That's what the old guy needed. Okay, now I'm looking for the old man and the old woman. It appears to be too dark inside as it in not yet finished. Well, it's a demo after all. <laughs> I can't go in this hut because it's only in the demo game. Okay, so I can put stuff like... Maybe this flower in here. <gasps> and then somehow there's like a contribution to the village and makes it grow or something. Wait, is this the old... No, that's not the old lady. Where's the old lady now? <laughs> Why are they so fast? They're gone. They're miles away. I have no idea where they are. I'm going to this giant tree. Wait, can I cross this river? No. Oh, I see the giant tree. It's right there. Okay, fine. Dodo wants to see the tree. Ooga booga. Dodo wants tree. Dodo wants see the tree. Oh, it's actually getting a little bit darker, I think. But it says I have a lot of daylight or energy. Maybe. Oh, that's my energy. Like how much work I can do. So you need to be clever and use your energy every day. Not too much. Not too little. I've used too little energy today. I spent the whole day looking for the old people. <laughs> and hopefully tomorrow my grandma. If, if she's my grandma. Is she my grandma? We'll be there, I hope. I'm so lost in my own village. Hello? Another river? Where's my home? I'm lost. And I need the old people. I'm looking for old people. Has anyone seen old people? Here they are, both are. But they're sleeping. Grandma. Grandma, listen. Gra Stop sleeping. Contribution points. Not euros. Okay, I have earned 10 contribution points by donating one flower. Okay, Grandma, Grandma, I need to talk to both of you. Please. How do I wake them up? I just know that they're just going to run away again. Hey, Grandma. 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 <gasps> Finally. I've been thinking about Inti. The bright fire in the sky. Oh, so you can make a sundial, which will show the time of the day. That's pretty awesome. It appears we haven't made enough contributions to research this. Sad. Very sad. Oh. Okay, so I need to make a lot of contributions to get my points up. So you just throw... That's the goal. To throw as much as possible into this thing here. Just throw everything. Blah, 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 blah. I'm just... I'm just throwing everything in here, okay? Also, I'm going to do some farming. I want to do some farming. Okay, I have no more stuff. I contributed everything. Okay, so now I'm going to do some farming over here yeah yeah plant the seed how do i water them wait how do you water the plants do we have bu a bucket or something do, 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 do. i have no seeds i have a tool oh i have a water skin i have a water skin right here look put it on my bar there we go okay 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 i have a water skin oh <gasps> Da, 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 da. I have a water skin and I will use it on the river. Oh, nice. 
Okay, so this is how farming works in this game. Okay, I've done my farming. I've done my contributions. Uh, I want to ride an ostrich or a dodo, but they don't have dodos in this game. So I want to ride an ostrich. Oh, wait. Is this not working? Oh, God. It is working. I guess I should have made an introduction. I'll make an introduction after this, I guess. So yeah, this is like a prehistoric farming town building game. So that's apparently what we're doing. So we're just getting as much stuff as possible, contributing it to the village. Then we can make upgrades to our village like a well or a sundial or more houses or more animals but you also have to like explore maybe i should explore and see if i can find some more animals <gasps> okay 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 so here we actually have a map oh it actually shows where everyone is this is what i needed yesterday when i was looking for the old people wait is this her mary yeah this is her she went all the way over there to the river to the on the other side of the field no wonder i can't find her Okay, so this game so far looks pretty cool. Even though it's still the demo, it is pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to play it a little bit longer and then I'll record again. I'm just going to pause the recording. Oh, ostriches. <gasps> okay, how do... Talk to Oka to find out more. <gasps> Are we going to learn to ride an ostrich? There's a baby ostrich. Uh, it doesn't respond. Uh, ostrich is kind of like a dodo. Just really big. Just big dodo. You're like big dodo. Ooh, here's the lady from the picture. This is the lady from the picture. Oka. You saw those beautiful animals too. They don't seem afraid at all, but don't pay us any attention either. The ostriches don't care about us. I do remember a story about animals that liked music though. Okay, so this cost 50 contribution. I've done a bunch of contributions. Uh, can you guys see it? I have now got 128 contributions. So this is actually the first time we, we are trying to get animals. We have never had animals in the history of forever. Okay, talk to the elders. So Igorork and Mary, who for some reason every day, this is the third day, they actually, every day they just go to the other side of the field to do some kind of suspicious stuff. I don't actually know what they're doing. Okay, let's go to them. Okay, so not him. He doesn't care. Mary. Mary. Okay, they don't care at all. What was the quest? The quest... Oh, is this because it's the beta and quests don't work or something? <laughs> Okay, so apparently what I had to do was just wait a day and then talk to her again, the lady with the wolf on her, Oka, and then she gave me a flute, because I can play the flute so beautifully. The birds will hopefully come with me? I will call you Big Dodo, because you look like a Big Dodo. Okay. Oh, I have to click when it hits the green, okay. <laughs> Okay, okay, you have to like time it. Do oh, they get it? Almost. Uh, d yes! <gasps> Dude, is he going to follow me? How about this one? Oh, you can tame them individually. Okay, th I'm going to tame all of them. Yes. Yeah. Oh, perf. Oh, did you see that one? Okay, okay, so we have one female. Oh, we need like a female and a male probably. But I don't see a male, do I? At least in Austria, usually the males have different colors. So this is probably not... Okay, that is pretty cool. This is how you tame the animals. Just by playing a song for them. That's awesome. Can I tame a mammoth as well? Can I tame a mammoth by playing a song? I want to tame a mammoth as well. Okay, so do these guys just come with me now? Come. Come, birds. No, they, just, they still don't care. They still don't care. Okay, I don't know. Ah, I just discovered new plants. If you pick a plant in the wild, you get a seed. And then you've discovered that. And then you can grow it for yourself. <gasps> okay, so this looks really cool. Look at this. You can see like behind, like behind below the mountain. Okay, can I play the flute for this thing? <gasps> I totally can. For the goats. And click. I get it. Yes, okay, I'll take one gray goat. Oh, wait. Oh, look at these horns on this one. Okay, I want this one with the big horns. I don't know if it matters because the ostriches didn't even come home with me. So I don't even know if it if it works. Discover more plants and then I can grow them next to my house. 
which is awesome because then I don't have to go all the way up this mountain. <laughs> I'm all the way up here. Here is my village. And I went all the way around up the mountain. And now I'm almost at this cave. Ooh, what's at the cave? Also, can I grow these trees like this? I got a pine cone. Do you think I can grow the tree at home? Hello? There's like a giant owl statue with three small owls? Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. No, I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, ooh, there's an owl button. Transmute. I turn into a bird. Dude, what is going on? I don't know what's going on. I actually... It's, it's not even something you have to learn. The game is like... Yeah, you turn into a bird. That's normal. What's so weird about that? You just turn into a bird. What do I do with the cave? I don't know. Oh! <gasps> Oh, I just opened a new area, I think. Let's see. Let's see what happens when you go here. Oh, mines. Oh, this way you can get like ores. And then you can... No way you can... Can you get iron from this? Oh, flint, of course. Okay, that makes actually a lot more sense. I don't know. Can you get to the iron age? Or even the bronze. Can you get to other ages in this game? I don't know. Also, I don't know what happens when you stay out until late. You guys cannot actually see this, but the game keeps saying it's like morning or evening. And also like what season it is and what year. It's spring, year one, Thursday four, the fourth day, and it's evening. And I have 90 contribution points. So that's all that it says. I think it's like one of those other games, but I never played it. What does this mean? Why is there so many owls here? Yeah, nor you just turn into a bird. What's well, not that's not weird, it's normal. You never turn into a bird? I turn into a bird all the time. Open sesame! Okay, this is actually pretty cool. Like you turn into the animals. <laughs> Go away, stones! <laughs> I cannot get rid of all these stones. Too many stones. They just keep coming back to me. Okay, so I played like an hour or two more since the last recording. I want to do one more thing. I talked to a guy and I completed a quest. I actually completed a bunch of missions now. Before when I talked to those old people, to my grandparents. Are they my grandparents? I don't know. But before when I talked to them, they wouldn't talk about what I had to talk about. Because you have to like right click them. So that's all I had to do. I just had to right click them. So now I've completed some quests. Here's my farm now. It's a little bit bigger as you can see. There's a well now here, which was one of the quests that I completed. I got a well and I got to choose where to put it. And I'm, I completed a quest where a guy was going to build a place to put the animals. So finally I'm going to have animals. Hopefully this works in a demo. Uh, because this is like the pre-alpha demo. So let's see. Oh, come on. I still don't have enough. I still don't have enough. Uh, okay. I have to go. Okay, fine. I'll I'll do. I'll be back. I'll be back. Will you build for me, please, a small shed? <gasps> oh, you can choose where it goes. Oh, you need to like clear enough room to put it. Wait, you cannot put it anywhere else. Can I just not just put it like here in the village? I thought this was a village building game. I can only put it on my farm. That's not fair. Okay, where's enough room? Okay, I can put it here. I think if I clear that whole area. Okay, I will have to clear that whole area. Okay, I think that's enough. Okay, while we're playing, I might as well talk about the game before we finish this video. Uh, my final thoughts on the game is that I think it's pretty awesome. Personally, I've never played Stardew Valley. It seems to be a lot like that game, but I've never played it. So I don't know if it's like a copy or different uh, because I've never played this game. But it looks very different because it's like prehistoric and... Also, it's not just about farming. There's like also animals and you can do buildings and it's about all those prehistoric things that you would have in your prehistoric life, you know? So that's pretty cool, I think. Okay, please build it now. Please work. Okay, that's enough room. Build. Click. Enter. Is it... <gasps> Okay, that looks like the perfect spot. I'll start working on it. 
Okay, I think it's going to just be more things. Every time I think it's going to work, it's not going to work. Okay, I'll just uh, record later when I'm uh, back. I will maybe record that part. Maybe without voice or face. I don't know, but I'll try to show you guys if I get my animals actually in there. Let me actually just do my final thoughts for this game. I really like the style of this game. It's like pixelated but also kind of cartoony. It's kind of in between. I really love farming games. Any farm, any game with farming, I love farming games, but this is not necessarily just a farming game. I love the fact there's like random animals. There's like ostriches and goats and mammoths. It's like random. It's so comfortable just walking around barefoot on the grass. When I made my character, I made sure to turn off the shoes. So I have just, I'm just walking around with no shoes on the grass. So comfortable, like paradise. Okay, so after I came back from where I had to go, I found out that the demo that I am playing actually doesn't save. So everything was gone. Uh, and I decided to start early the next day, like in real life, so I could just play the whole day and see what I would find. One day I found a light puzzle in the caves where an owl spirit... Owl, owl. Owl. That's such a weird word. I found a light puzzle in the caves where an owl spirit spoke to me and rewarded me with a torch. I finally finished the sundial and was I was actually allowed to choose where you put it in the village. That is so cool, I think, especially when you're playing with your friends and you have to like talk to your friends and decide together where you want everything to be like the houses and the sundial and other things uh when i had the sundial it actually told me exactly the time in the game and not just like afternoon or evening one thing I really like is that every villager is different and has like their own job and whatever they do in the village. Like someone foresees the weather, someone makes tools, someone makes buildings, someone uh, looks after the fire so the fire doesn't go out. So yeah, they all have their own jobs and I really like that. I found out that there's a lady called Acre and she's the toolsmith and after I collected some stuff for her and waiting a few days, she actually made a hammer for mining and an axe for chopping down trees. Both of these were better than the flint hand axe that you get from the beginning. But the demo actually had only one more tool after that and it was called the obsidian hammer, an even better uh, yeah, hammer to mine stone with. And I actually worked for real life hours to get it, going to the mine every single in-game day to look for obsidian and collecting as many contribution points as possible because I actually needed a shocking 1500 for the obsidian hammer. Sadly, I didn't know that the demo demo actually has a limited time which is 25 days so i failed to actually get the hammer in time i was working so hard every day to get enough obsidian but then the game suddenly just ended um after about like well actually 25 maybe 30 days but i actually needed like 20 obsidian to make the hammer i was only finding like one obsidian a day so i didn't make it sadly on the bright side that guy i think his name was croc finally finished my barn and i found out how to bring animals home after you play a song you actually have to give them some i guess food they like i just tried with the tomato and it worked uh, and then you have to click tame on them just like this except I already put all the ostriches in so I tried it with this little goat and it didn't work because the barn was already full with ostriches. Speaking of ostriches I actually got to spend an entire day with these long neck dodos because I got stuck in the barn. Yeah. Uh <laughs> For such an early version of the game, it actually had very few problems and bugs. But this one was a little bit annoying because every game day it was really important. Especially when I found out that the game ends after like 25 days. So getting stuck for a whole day in the barn was kind of a waste of time. So I'm going to have to be honest and also say something bad about the game. I actually liked almost everything. Uh, if I had to choose my least favorite part, it's probably the energy bar. Even though I'm not entirely sure how it's going to work um, because in a demo luckily for me the energy bar just you can just keep going even when the energy bar is empty so if that's really the same in the game then I don't understand how it works maybe I'm wrong but what I'm guessing is that once they make more of the game, the when the energy bar is empty, you have to go to sleep. And if that is how it works, then it would actually make the game less fun for me. Uh, I just imagine playing the game, you just wake up in the game, and then you do some farming, and then you have to go to bed right away in the morning, because your energy is, you're just out of energy. That would be really sad. So, um, I think that can definitely 
uh, break or make the game, I guess. Like, it could ruin the game if they don't do it right. But maybe they will make it work in a way that's m more fun. Because, of course, for me, I could just keep going without energy. So I don't actually know how it's going to work. All in all, I love playing the demo for this game. And I can't wait when it comes out. I really look forward to starting a Stone Age village with some friends. Maybe even you guys. Maybe we can hunt and tame some mammoths. Uh, we, do, we can actually do some ostrich racing. Which I couldn't do in this video because I was doing single player but with friends you can actually raise ostriches so if you're as excited as i am please consider supporting the game financially on their kickstarter if you want to contribute to a little village already go to their discord and play the chatbot version of the game and last but not least wishlist the game on steam to make sure you get notified when it comes out that's it for this video. I hope I covered everything. If there's anything more you want to see, uh, let me know. Thank you all for watching. Special thank you to Cry Tifo and Soda Den for letting me play the demo. And don't forget to stomp like an ostrich.